New developments tonight involving a local moving company and overcharge complaints. The Attorney General's office just sued Always Moving, also called All Stars Moving, at its owners. The suit asks for huge monetary penalties and that the owners be kept out of the moving business for good. There's a long list of accusations here, some of the same things we've been investigating and exposed earlier this week. The Attorney General lawsuit accuses Always All Stars Movers of not even being licensed, bonded, or insured, that they were failing to disclose all fees, finding justifications to deny most consumers' claims for reimbursement, and charging fees for work hours not performed. 14 hours, I think, they charged me for. But Jane Weaver of Mesa says her move took just six hours. She hired All Stars Moving for their $44.99 an hour price and says on the day of the move, workers handed her a contract with blank prices. I needed my initials before they would pick up one piece of furniture. What she thought would cost less than 500 bucks came to four times that amount. They were not going to take a piece of furniture off until they got $2,090 cash. Her bill included 14 hours and more than 10 charges for moving a gun safe that she doesn't have. Those undisclosed extra fees are part of the AG's lawsuit. In 2010, their office also sued the business, then called All Ways Moving over some of the same issues. It included an $80,000 judgment to be paid by 2013. The AG says it's still not even half paid. Jane would like to see some of her money back, saying there's no way her move took 14 hours. You ready? Yep. Okay, all right, let's start this thing. So we timed it. A mover with a good reputation, Move Smart Moving in Phoenix, agreed to make the same move. We're going to go ahead and move all the furniture onto the truck. Same belongings, same number of workers. For this move to take as long as it took, yeah. That's just ridiculous. With everything moved on the truck, it took just two hours, 21 minutes. And by the time Move Smart Moving took everything back in the house, and we added an hour for shrink wrap time in the 18 mile drive, it came to just six hours. It just supports exactly what I was, was trying to tell them all along. By phone, All Stars Moving defended Jane's charges, along with prohibiting owners from being in the moving business. This lawsuit also asks for a lot of money, up to $10,000 per willful violation and up to $25,000 for each violation involving that 2010 judgment. And the Attorney General is asking All Stars Movers and their owners to pay back consumers' money and property.